Many developments are taking place in the southeastern region of Ukraine. With Ukraine's extensive operation in this region, several of Russia's largest logistics centers have been damaged. The fact that Ukraine attacked this point with long-range weapons and was successful has made Russia think. Russia must now be more prepared, because with the Ukrainian artillery doubling its range, the danger awaiting Russia is now greater. Russia continues to work with mercenary groups on the front line. The Russians have recently moved some of their Wagner Group soldiers towards the Volda region. Several explosions were heard in Mariupol. This tells us that elements in this area have been targeted by Ukrainian long-range missiles. And along with this development, it was recently learned that the Ukrainian army hit six Russian logistics centers. These are Mariupol, Donetsk, Makievka, Kartsysk, Debeltsev and Ilaves. The offensive of the Ukrainian army continues successfully. It remains to be seen how the Russian army will respond. It has been confirmed that Ukrainian forces destroyed an ammunition depot at the airport west of Mariupol. It is also confirmed that the Ukrainian army destroyed a Russian base with a large number of troops in the city. Along with these attacks, the Ukrainian army is also carrying out other operations. It is known that the Ukrainian army is also targeting the routes that Russia loses for supply. And by looking at the explosion images, we can say that the Ukrainian army is also targeting Russian ammunition depots and striving to completely deplete Russia's dwindling ammunition. Knowing that Russia has an ammunition problem, the Ukrainian army has been working on this situation for a very long time. The Ukrainian army which identifies the locations of Russian ammunition depots and attacks these points, puts Russia in a very difficult situation. It is estimated that Russia will face a real shortage of ammunition if this continues.